Do you know how hard it is to narrow down five mods that you must have in your game for The Sims 4? What's up, boo? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to the dark side because today I am giving you my top five mods for The Sims 4. It took me some brain power to decide which mods to include on this list. Let's go ahead and jump right in because the first mod I want to talk to you and show you about is the Be a Burglar mod from Need Coffee for that. Now, I've mentioned this mod a lot of times. And the reason I put this mod on this list is because a lot of us do want burglars back in the sims especially the sims 4 so it allows your sims to become an actual burglar now it's 9 p.m my sim looks i mean she looks you know like she would so i'm in cast and i am gonna put some sort of hat on my sim because i feel like if i want to be a burglar and let, let me act the part now i could do one mm, you know what we're gonna stick with this you know what uh, nikoff if i did this maybe i could put on like a nice little turtleneck or something does it come in black it does well it, it fits you know what little black skirt it's robbing houses but make it fashionable and the good part is it's kind of like halloween so nobody's going to be none the wiser that i'm out in a mask because you know it's halloween they're like oh you're trick-or-treating yeah i'm trick-or-treating your valuables all right so let's find a house i don't think i've ever stolen from this house so let's do break in and it's raining outside but we're gonna pretend that it's not raining you know the sim is all about imagination even when it's telling you one thing i'm like nope it doesn't count now the skill is at level five in burglary so i shouldn't have any sort of issues if i do have an issue i'm gonna be upset why is there a ghost right there hello success lock busted door open be careful now you you don't want anyone to see you Purr. now i am going to put the walls halfway and i know somebody lives here because i kind of practice on this place. oh maybe he out you know what it don't matter all right so what can i steal can i steal the bed i can sell woohoo on your bed let me do okay let me okay Mm, see i don't really rob things so it's like do you do the first floor do you do the second floor like what can you actually okay i can get some paintings all right good so we're gonna swipe the paintings be a good burglar like a good burglar stay over no, I'm, I'm sorry i try to do the jingle i don't know somebody help me in the comments like you know the like a good neighbor state farm is there but like like a good burglar i need the second half of that can i steal the lighting i can't steal the lighting any other paintings i can steal mm, i can't steal your plan oh i can see your tv you know steal your tv fun fact my house has actually been burglared and they could not take the tv it was you know mounted to the wall so they busted the tv because they could not take it but in the sims you can take the tv all right uh i don't think there's anything downstairs i kind of feel wrong trying to take things from the kids room but you know nothing left behind can i take this can i take this can i take this i guess this kind of makes sense that you can't take furniture do y'all really not have like a oh okay here's another painting i'm so glad i think they're just out we're gonna assume that they're out did anyone see her no nobody didn't see her see me because i'm not really here i don't think there's anything else i can take let me see yeah, I can't take mirrors. Is there anything outside? I don't think I could put the grill. Actually, let me take the grill. Oh, I can take the grill. Y'all, I can steal their grill. I can't. Oh, I can sit the picnic table too. You know what? Don't tell me I'm not an equal, I'm not an opportunist. Okay. Can I take the, but I can't take the chairs though. That's kind of weird. Thank you. Let me see. Anything else? I think I'm good. You know what? Let's go home and let's see how much money we made. I'm actually going to zero her out too. We got to run. We got to hit. And anybody sees me, they think, oh trick-or-treating you know and then we're gonna sell everything wait i can't even sell this come here you should have let me steal that because what we're about to put this right here child okay can i take it from here no it just says stolen you know what we're not gonna talk okay but here's everything else Ooh, i did good you know what i feel like if i could sell this i will be well over eight thousand simoleons but i think i did good so yeah that is the be a burglar mod from knee coffee for that go and get this mod especially you want burgling you want a little bit of crime a little bit of chaos in your game but let's move on to the next mod all right the next mod i'm gonna show you is the hotel mod right, so the next mod i want to show you is the pair paradise hotel from grumpy that gives you functional hotels in the sims 4 now this actually is getting an update or it has an update but shout out to grumpy for sending me the updated version Just have some new build by object but for the sake of you know just using the mod i'm gonna use the new app well like 
app icon it appears on your phone and then book a suite and we're gonna head on oh, why is that bunny looking at me all right so let's do which suite would you like to book just know the eating suite costs 150 per night the car last week costs 225 and our penthouse suite costs 500 of course we're going to do the penthouse suite because why not also because that's the only suite that i actually like put the new items in and we're going to stay for i want to stay for a night okay and a little 500 simoleons i know we're not balling i mean we are balling but we balling paradise hotel and resort now the last time i did this if you didn't check out my initial video i put this lot in willow creek and afterwards i was like it doesn't feel this needed a hotel resort so now i'm putting it in the actual destination world so i feel like it works here this lot comes with the mod but you can also build your own just make sure you give it the appropriate lot types and you put like all the doors and everything that it needs for functionality but we're here it's cold and we're gonna go inside because it's cold okay a very cold there are some employee sims around like the receptionist and if you didn't want to use the phone you can book a suite using this object here but i am going to my suite which is upstairs and oh who was oh okay that you already here gavin gavin like i'm in my room okay and let me go to my suite which is the penthouse suite world of royal penthouse suite and i can tell because of this signage but i do have like a lot of stairs i need to go up on it, it, it's a lot of stairs to the penthouse okay boom yay i'm in my room now i do want to show off some of the new items from my original video so there is now mini bars it's like two different mini bars you can take a drink here i when i go to hotels i don't use the mini bars because like it, it'd be the mini bars be really expensive okay so we got water juice soda Ooh, and they're free i guess since i'm paying 500 a night it better be free okay i'm gonna take a drink then there's a safe where you can open you can store things i've never used the safe in hotels either i probably should for all those valuables but like i feel like i would mess it up or lose the code or something like that so i just don't if you've ever worked in a hotel let me know like how do the safes work like do you just come in afterwards and you reset everything like how does how does that work let me actually go to the bathroom let's use this pretty much it like your sim can uh, use the amenities here they have their room also once you're here you have you can ask for breakfast you can get some food into your inventory bicycles made and repair services they'll come up here clean or fix anything book for other sims you can want to invite your family members all that good y'all this hotel kind of just opened and somebody's already dying like the sis literally just died in the pool um well he's about to die too you know what maybe it's my fault because this is kind of like a resort yeah you know it's not my fault you know what there should be lifeguards on duty anyway grim can you chop chop because i need to go there's nothing to do with me i'm not answering any questions at all but anyway yeah that is the <laughs> paradise hotel and resort mine from grumpy make sure you go and you check it out but let's move on to the next mod all right the next mod i want to show you is the functional wall phone from a winged llama now you're probably wondering troy why this mod now of course a lot of people don't use landlines now but we did back in the day and i felt like this mod is kind of perfect for those sims who want to use a landline you want that kind of realistic gameplay with the landline and we just don't have that like even the phone is like an app you know it's, it's barely you know yeah anyway so this mod gives you three different types of phones and you get all of these options. so you can order delivery you can hire a service you can call the fire department call the adoption agency you can travel using this mod you can invite out book a vacation move your household from this social ask on the date chat with invite over plan an event purchase a business from here do some career things like find a job and i believe if you yeah if so if you shift left click you can enable phone calls or disable phone calls where you will randomly just get phone calls throughout the day and this is such a cool mod social chat with um i'm gonna chat with vlad because i'm talking to vlad in a while it's like 8 a.m okay i feel like we're gonna use the interview with a vampire and he doesn't really need to be asleep when the sun comes up but he just does it oh okay you said i'm sleeping and i'll call you later okay well um is there anybody else dominic maybe <laughs> dominic could call me i really like the fact your sims actually do pick up the phone so yeah i used to call it, uh let's see career let me i can find a job of course they'll probably just bring up the phone panel brings up the phone panel and i can give myself a job i wish it was just easy in real life getting a job i really wish it was that is the functional wall phone from a winged llama but let's move on to the next mod all right so the next mod i want to show you is a mod that without a out i'm gonna always say that you need this in your game it is the sims national bank mod from 
Simrealist and Roberki. Now this gives your Sim optional bank accounts in The Sims 4. Your Sims can have their own separate bank account. You can have checking, savings, you can do direct deposit. You can do a lot with this mod. Now the one feature I do want to focus on is the debit cards. My Sim already has their own checking account because I don't set it up but i am going to go ahead and order a debit slash credit card now i'm going to do the smb debit card and it says the smb debit card for from checking is on the way and will be delivered by mail the card should arrive soon in your mailbox thank you for choosing smb perfect now you kind of saw some of the other things that you can do you can delete your account you can customize your account icon so that way you can easily see what is what because you can have multiple accounts you can transfer deposit to manage account owners like you can actually add a sim onto your account so that way they can have access to it like this is the per like when i say this is a chef's kiss mod this is a chef mod and i love the fact what they've done since it first came out it was you no know, when if mod first came out into what it is now it's like night and day but it's still the same exact per oh i should have paid my bills should have paid my bills and then let's get mail i don't know how long it takes realistically to get everything in there but we'll figure it out now the mail just came and they turned off my power again i paid the bill before before you even say anything but let's see if our debit card is in here and hopefully it is and it is so now we can use for martha's daily transactions this item cannot be sold or deleted so i can destroy the card give give card give this card to someone else only premier checking account owners may use this card transfer manage premier checking account and transfer from so i can actually it says use okay so it looks like it's on i wonder if i can go down here and it will order food and let's see how this works where is she oh she's here bam and there you go come here checking out you have made a payment of 20 simoleons towards this transaction so once you turn that on anything you buy you will use your checking account for it looks like and i think see manage and direct deposit account history oh and it shows it actually it shows the account history too it said 13 minutes ago so that way you can keep track of your sims but oh great now you gotta keep track of your sim spending while you're in game okay it's great anyway yeah this mod is amazing make sure you go and you check it out but let's move on to the last mod all right so the last mod i'm going to talk to you and show you is the realistic pregnancy override or rpo from lump and know that this mod has 18 plus one module because one just came out where your sims overhaul romance pregnancy relationships everything is overhauled with this mod now i'm going to show you some of the features and things that you can do with it now first of all the first major feature that i loved with this mod when it first came out was was the fact that your sim can have like paternity tests or they can get wtds it was so good now i'm gonna go ahead and just like cheat this person's relationship real quick because i don't have time to be think oh not 200 to run cheat and now you can talk about your woohoo preferences so woohoo life is one of the new modules where your sims can have a nice little woohoo life you know like you got woohoo health you can ask about protection pregnancy and family ask a camera wants children cheating and fidelity confess for loving another uh, insemination and surrogacy you can make up and you can break up adoption is here your own sim has some options that they can do you can do like woohoo hookup there's also a nice app called meet and mingle that you can use that comes with this for dating this mod is just it's beefy but it has a lot of realistic gameplay so let me see woohoo life get supplements for woohoo drive if you want to see like a nice rundown on this new module check out the video that I just linked in the icard because i do go over it romance and relationships you can decide to always be faithful you can do your turn-ons and turn-offs you can decide that not to become friends you can not to develop feelings you can it's, it's just so it's just so so good you can do your thoughts of being pregnant like okay with being pregnant not okay with being pregnant you can let's do adoption let's do cheating what else you can carry a baby for others sim you can do a lot of this stuff so if you've ever been on the fence with rpo then i highly suggest you do give it some thought and you do check it out but yeah that is the end of this video i hope you enjoyed it. If you have your own top five mods, let me know what they are in the comments below. But I will see you next time. Bye, boo.